Democrats already talking about impeachment, talking about using the 25th Amendment to... Are they getting ahead of themselves? And is there a danger that the Democrats could sort of overplay their hands on this the way the Republicans did with Bill Clinton? Yeah, well, I see no no sign that there's... Uh, that there's, uh, you know, any likelihood that he'll be impeached. I think the, uh, the Republican leadership has decided, um, you know, we're in the boat with him and we're, the boat's going to sink and we're going to sink with it, or, but, but uh, we can't really throw him out of the boat. That's not going to be uh, politically viable for us. So they've decided to, uh, as, I've, as I've said before, Velcro their fate to, to him. I think they must be... Uh, waking up in a sweat at night thinking about what the prospects of that are. Uh, but I, I think there's no chance that the House would mount uh, the kind of serious investigation that would uh, uh, lead to impeachment. And as for the uh, 25th Amendment, do you really think Mike Pence and, you know, uh, as I said, Betsy DeVos is going to sign that piece of paper relieving the president of his duties? I don't see that either. So it really is left uh, to Bob Mueller uh, to conduct a complete investigation uh, and to do um, uh, and to um, ask the hard questions and you know again there's uh, uh, new information that comes out every day including the fact that uh, the FBI under Comey's leadership had focused in on someone senior in the White House uh, we haven't uh, been uh, we're not certain about who that is but but it's not just Mike Flynn it's not just Paul, Paul Manafort it's uh, you know, uh, not just the people who they, they've uh, kind of pushed out or pushed aside, but people actively uh, in the White House that are, be, are, are under investigation. And I think, uh, yeah, I, 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 m you know, my own view and I, uh, from experience of uh, been in, being involved in politics for a very long time, it's usually not what you did back then, it's what you say now that gets you in trouble. And uh, for a group of people who seem to have a very tenuous grasp on the truth, um, the chance of lying in an official investigation is pretty high.